Hello everyone, Tom from Weingarts. Today we're going to be showing you how to replace the rear wheels on your Toro lawnmower. This particular model is a 20332. We have a rear wheel which was provided to us by Weingarts Supply. You can pick up the wheels from us at weingarts.com. Our tools we're going to need today is a 13 millimeter socket, a ratchet, and a piece of 2x4. Now we'll use our 13 millimeter socket with our ratchet and we'll go ahead and take the wheel off. Now when you take the wheel off, there's a little washer that you're going to get off once you take the plastic backing plate off. Do not lose that washer. You will have to put it back when you go to reinstall the wheel. That plastic washer does just reinsert back into the cover. We're going to take the wheel off. We're going to inspect it for any type of dirt debris that might be caught in the wheel. Uh, we're going to check the teeth for any type of uneven wear or even miss or broken teeth. Don't see a whole lot here. Everything does look pretty good, uh, but we're going to go ahead and replace it. We're going to reinsert the bolt. Again, just make sure the bolt's clean from dirt or debris. Reinstall it back into the wheel. And we're going to reinstall our backing plate. Again, installing the washer. Now once you put the backing plate on, there is a hole for the drive, the drive gear. You will want to reinsert the drive gear and put the wheel back on. Again, when installing the bolt, please do so by hand. If you do so with any type of tools, you run the risk of actually stripping out the bolt or the adapter that it's bolted to. So what we'll do is we'll just put it on finger tight and then we'll use our ratchet to finish the job. And once you got it tight, just give it another quarter turn just to make sure she's tight. Check the wheel to make sure she free rolls, we don't have anything loose or binding. And that is how we replace the wheel on our Toro lawnmower. Wine guards, wine guards, everything.